Hello ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, this is Magnius and welcome to a new world and new episode of Minecraft Dinosaurs. So, I have indeed, I believe, updated to version 1.5.2 because I'm not exactly sure that the fan revival mod is working on 1.6.1. So... For the most part, we've updated to 1.5.2. We have installed Ray's minimap, as you can see. I have installed the fossil and archaeology mod, which I can confirm, I believe, by... Let's see, where where was it? It was somewhere, somewhere right over here. No? Somewhere. Some, there it is. There it is. Let's just hop down here. And just sitting up here on the surface... There is a fossil, so it's good to know that the mod is installed and stuff, DNA can be dug up. I guess technically not DNA, but you guys know what I'm talking about. Fossils, we've done this before. I, uh, I explored a little bit and I made a lot of maps to try to find a place that I enjoyed. I really like this place right here. There's a desert over there. There's like a snow biome over there somewhere. Jungle, and there's a freaking giant hill, which we may turn into something later. But yes, I enjoy this area, so I've decided that I'm going to live here. Um, for those of you who I know are going to ask for the seed, there is the seed. Enjoy it. Write it down. Take a screenshot, because I swear I will not be giving you guys the seed in the future. <laughs> this is the very first episode of this world. There's the seed. Deal with it. All right. So I went ahead and used the bonus box, the bonus chest, to go ahead and get some stuff early on. Because I didn't want to, like, collect wood for quite so long. One of the first things we have to do is... Oh, I haven't I haven't placed my, uh... My archaeology workbench. It's not really an archaeology workbench, but hey, you know, Mod has strange names. I'm sensing a little bit of lag. Anyway, there's my hoe. Because we need food. Because this is survival. see how how many of these do we need I don't, I don't know one two three four five food is important we uh we don't really have the uh the time i think in the very first episode to set up a real farm but this will do for now yeah there we go uh i don't i don't know if that's going to keep us alive but it'll have to do so let's go ahead and... It has been so long since I've been at this point in the game. I think we need to get some stone. Because the first thing that we're going to need, we're going to need some coal. Going to make a furnace. Because I know where there are some fossils already. Another reason, another reason. Actually, I'll show you guys. Oh, that's, that's not quite what I wanted. Another reason that I chose this place actually is because... There are lots of cave systems nearby. Like, uh, oh, that's sort of frightening. I think I'm just going to put that right there so I can jump. Right over here, I believe. Yes, right over here. There's an entrance. There's lots of fossils in there. There may also be some coal. Not exactly sure yet. And also, in addition to this, there is, let's see, somewhere over here. I don't want to run. Because I don't want to kill myself by starving to death, which is completely a possibility. Oh, actually, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, we're we're on normal. Uh, I don't want to die. Somewhere, somewhere around here is a giant hole in the ground. I'm not. This is not it. No, it must be over here. But yeah, when I saw this place, I just knew that this is where we had to start. And I, I can confirm, by the way, that Spinosaurs are indeed in this version of the mod. Which is awesome. Some more caves. Where's the huge cave? The huge cave was around here somewhere. Is this it? No? All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get lost if I continue going like this for too long. But somewhere, somewhere around here is a huge hole, and I definitely wanted to explore it. That is that is some coal. I will remember that coal is over there. But yes, 
So here we are. This is our new home. And there are sheep and cows aplenty. So I know precisely what I am going to do. I need to make a bed. Oh, the things that I need to do. What to do, what to do. Maybe we'll just grab some stone for now. Oh, sigh. So I just wanted to point out that just in case you guys say that I shouldn't have updated, I put it to a vote. If you guys didn't want us to update, you should have commented. This is where we're going from now, and I'm looking forward to the future. Of course, there are lots of other things to look forward to as well. Lots and lots of things. Lacuna Passage being one of the things I'm most excited about at the moment. I'm in the process of making a, a Lacuna Passage video. Lacuna Passage, as some of you may know if you're interested in space and space games, Lacuna Passage is a Mars game. It is being developed by Random Seed Games. They have a Kickstarter right now, and I'm going to link you to that Kickstarter actually in this, the description below. And it is a based on Mars sur Hello Enderman survival and exploration game. Basically, you end up on Mars. You're on Mars, and you go to Mars so that you can find out what happened to the first set of people that you send to Mars, because they seem to have disappeared, you've lost contact with them. And you, oh, I'm going to die of starvation. Oh, and by the way, also the coordinates, if you want to actually show up where I am after you use the seed, look up there at Ray's minimap, negative 763, positive 49, that should get you pretty close. I think, I think I need to cut down some trees. Possibly get some apples. I guess I could also kill some cows. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll kill some cows. I don't like killing cows. Cows... Killing cows tends to make me sad, because I consider them my friends. But oh well. Into every life some rain must fall. And today... Today the rain is coming down on the cows, I suppose. Oh, woe is me. I still haven't decided the name of our little pink sheep who is going to be our first addition to our family, by the way. So if you have any ideas about that, go back to the last video where we birthed that sheep. Beef. And let me know what you would like to name that sheep. And indeed, that will be the first addition to our family here in our new world. Oh, leather. That's nice. Alright. And I can use wood. I think I can use wood. Let's see. Does this work? Yes, it does. Very nice. Okay. No problem. No problem whatsoever. I'm just going to wait for that. Oh, and by the way, instead of not enough items, I accidentally installed too many items, I think. Yes. And I don't have recipe mode, so I'm going to try to fix that later. But in the meantime, I have a different mod that I'm used to, and it's sort of, sort of scaring me. Oh. Well, that's not good at all. How about this? Will this work longer? Maybe? No. No, it does not. Alright, that's that's good to know. Thank you. Oh, that, that's very disappointing. Alright. <laughs> good, good to know. Do not use wood because it takes for freaking ever. I suppose we need to kill some sheep. And make ourselves a bed. Otherwise... Nighttime is gonna suck. Hmm. Alright. Where's some sheep? I don't want to deal with skeletons and creepers. Not this time. Oh no. Oh no. Sheep. Mm -hmm. 
I apologize, sheep. I, I realize that this isn't exactly the best way for us to become friends. Should I go for... This one? Yeah. You look like a nice sheep. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's only one. It's not enough. It's not enough. Are you serious? Nothing? Nothing? Oh man. Alright, there we go, there we go. Um, wonderful, and it's raining. <laughs> Nothing like coming into your new home and it be raining in death. And I can't hear myself think. That's nice. There's a zombie over there. I do not have a sword. I do not have armor. At least there's squid nearby. Hello, squid. That is a creeper as well. Wonderful. I forgot how stressful it is starting out a new game of Minecraft. I'm slightly worried. Is there... I'm just... Just gonna, just gonna try to do this really quickly. I'm just, I'm just gonna run away from you guys. Don't, don't mind me. Um... Maybe, maybe there aren't any monsters over here? Is this far enough away? Maybe not. Can I sleep? Yes. Yes, I can. Shh. And it's morning. My bed is in a strange place, but I'm not too worried about that. All right. Uh... The rain has stopped, thank goodness. Oh my gosh. Let's see if we can get any any of this goo. I've never actually cared about goo before. Oh, the skeletons are hiding in the trees. Sneaky. Oh, I see you. I see you, creeper. Soon. Alright, anyway. Oh, that's over. I actually, I've never actually used this meat for anything at all. But why not? Why not? Alright, I think I need to make a stone pick. That should be my next priority. There we go. Alright. Now let's see, I need iron and coal. I think I have plenty of health, hunger. I think we're good. I just need to find some coal and iron, preferably in a place that's not very high, because I can't, oh, oh, hello, hello? Is there anyone in here? I, oh, yes, yes there is, hello, I uh, I should have made a sword. Retrospect. Hindsight is 2020. Get back. 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 Thank you. Okay, good. Um. Alright. Is there anything? Yes. Very nice. Cool. Oh, the coal that we shall have. Can't get to you yet, fossils, but soon. Soon, fossils. Just just hold on just a little bit. There we go. There's some more coal. I cannot reach it. Um, I need to collect some more dirt. I love how despite the fact that, you know, I've been playing this game for a while now. Like, 54 episodes, I think. And yet... And yet, I still don't feel like I actually know what I'm doing. Oh well. These things too come to pass. And soon we'll be back where we were before with a sustainable home, not worrying about constantly dying. But 
it shall take us time. I'm actually really interested to see how many of my subscribers follow along with us. If they come and make a, make a camp in the same area as we live in right now. I think that would be cool. If you guys would like to post some of your video responses of you living in this area as well. That would be really interesting. I would like to see your videos. I know that that probably sounds really strange. Because surely, surely Magnius wouldn't watch our videos. But actually I do. You can ask Jody. Jody Lawrence, I believe his name is. I've watched all of his videos that he's made in responses to my videos. And it was good times. It feels, it feels strange talking about dinosaurs because we don't have any dinosaurs yet. <laughs> I suppose... Okay, I'm going to put half of those in there. And the other half I will make into torches. I need torches to be able to find my way around. Hmm. Alright. And I don't want to be anywhere near you. Okay, I'm just... Run away. Alright. Well, at least now I have some dirt. That's nice. Alright, and... what's in here? There's another creeper in here. Wonderful. So many creepers. Are you stuck in a block? You're stuck in a block, aren't you? Run right away. Are you... are you going to explode? Ah! I see you. Nope. Ah! Man, freaking creepers everywhere, man. Just... Ah, bones. Very nice bones. Always need more bones. Uh... I would like to find some surface iron. Surface iron would be fun. Because I would like an iron pick. Hmm. Hmm. The search continues. It feels, yeah, like I said, it feels strange to try to talk about dinosaurs when there are no dinosaurs here yet. I suppose... I suppose we didn't really start talking about dinosaurs until we started making dinosaurs in the last series. Any spider? Hel Hello, spider? The... G <laughs> ah, caving. Caving still freaks me out. All right, um, iron, hello. All right, so I'm gonna go back and get that iron and grab the coal as well. Very nice. So, I'm I'm trying to figure out if the game feels any different with the new updated. I think the graphics may have changed just a little bit. When I started playing it at first, there it felt oddly different, and I'm not really sure why. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm a little bit crazy. It just feels different to me. Like something feels a little bit off. Ugh. Uh, spider walking sound. I have no idea where you are, walking spider. You're probably down here, aren't you? No? Oh, hello, skill. Ow! Run, ow! Run, 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 run! Get away, get away! Ow! Okay, we're good. Yeah, no problem. No problem whatsoever. We're good, we're good. What in here? Is there something interesting in here? No? No iron to be found? Oh, there are a couple of new things in the mod. I think they added back in the, the pirate ships. In my version of the mod, version 1.6, 
pirate ships were basically non-existent. I searched everywhere for them. They just, I couldn't find them. They weren't anywhere to be found. And that's very unfortunate because the pirate ships were one of the really cool things about the fossil and archaeology mod, in addition to the uh, abandoned academies. So hopefully, eventually, we'll find some pirate ships. We can check those out. That would be cool. So many fossils, and I don't have any iron yet. Yet. Let's go get an iron pickaxe right now. That, that'll be a good place to end the episode, probably. Maybe? I hate not having enough food to be able to sprint. Alright, let's go ahead and put this in here. Nice. And... Cut down a tree. Hmm. Alright. Not bad. We have a bed. It's not exactly in a house yet. But we're gonna have ourselves an iron pick right about now. There we go. And now we can get our hands on those delicious fossils. I want to grab one fossil before the end of this episode so that we can say successfully that we got fossils and we didn't completely spend this episode doing completely newbie things. So where, where, where is that fossil? There are tons of you in here. I know there are. Don't you hide from me. There you are. All right. It's a bone. All right. So apparently they changed the fossil blocks to where you can also get a piece of stone randomly, which uh, did not happen in the past. I don't think. Here we go. Let's jump down here. Hey, look at that stone. It's lame. I don't want a freaking piece of stone. I want biofossils. What is that? Ah, a tablet. Okay, so we got a tablet. Another bone. Ah, oh, come on. Come on, man. Just, just give us a biofossil and we'll be done with it. We'll be done with it. I can't see it's getting dark. Oh no. I suppose actually we should put down a uh huh. We should put down a marker in Ray's mini map since this is our home. And we can always lose our home if we're not too careful. Must get to our bed before Monsters spawn. Oh, this is going to end up being a slightly longer episode. I'm okay with that because episode one, episode one, we have, we have to do, hello? We have, okay, good. Wow, and we're awake. So episode one, we have a lot of little nonsense stuff to do. And for those people who hate seeing the nonsense stuff like collecting iron and stone and such, I guess they can just skip. They can skip episode 1. Episode 2 will be much better and more in line with things that they want to see. Ah. I feel I feel very different this time starting again. It's such a strange feeling. It's like I remember when I first started I was I was such a new and naive YouTuber. I I didn't I didn't feel any sort of pressure to conform and be very popular or be funny I just I just talked and I was like hey guys I suck at this game and I'm okay with that and everything was good now things feel very very different I feel I feel as if I don't talk about dinosaurs then then people yes there we go biofossil very nice our very first biofossil in our new world very nice all right but yeah, I feel as if I don't talk about dinosaurs or talk about very interesting new things. I suppose we'll talk about the e ESA's new plans for a new rocket next episode, since that's some cool new stuff. But yeah, I spent like two hours updating this 
the stuff today, so maybe maybe that's why it feels so strange. I'm really tired. But anyway, it'll be better next episode. We'll be all energized and excited about our new biofossils. So thank you very much, everyone, for watching. I hope you join me using the seed and the coordinates. Come join us next to the giant hill, the desert, the jungle, and there's snow biome somewhere over there. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. My name is Megnius, and I will see you next time.